Hello and welcome everybody and thanks for joining me again. My name is Wilkie and I am finally back with some more PvP on my Kung Fu Master. And I actually have a two win streak which is not terribly much. And I'm fighting against the summoner I did actually fight against a couple minutes ago already. So this should actually work relatively easy. Unless he completely changed his skill build and kind of just rapes me. But uh, yeah, we're just gonna keep this the way it is now and uh, yeah, the reason maybe maybe some people are interested in the way I play against summoners is a bit different from most people. Uh, mainly because I switched my Searing Calm to the, I guess, PvE one for a simple reason actually. And that is because it does not require me to have one target locked down. I can freely switch between both targets whenever I get the opportunity to. And uh, yeah, the problem, or the other problem actually is that... Oh damn, that was nice. Eh, uh, damn you. The other problem being is that Searing Palm, or the way the combo works, is that you create an additional 2 second stun on one target, which is, I guess you can call it marked. And the problem with that being is that if you're fighting against a summoner, one of the classes, or one of the, I guess, subjects you're fighting is either the summoner or the cat, and you cannot stun both of them with the 3 or F follow-up. So that is kind of kind of an issue there, because, uh, yeah, like I said, you cannot stun both of them at the same time with the... Searing Palm Stun, which is actually the reason why I prefer the other one. I kind of messed it up here, which is actually why I'm struggling kind of a lot, but it should work out relatively well. He's probably using... Oh, no. Huh? What? Uh-oh. Uh -oh, oh, damn. Why can't... Why the hell was my tap not working? What the hell? Alright, this actually may be kind of tricky. Alright. Uh, what? I'm not exactly sure if it's lagging or if I'm lagging or whatever, or if the servers are crashing. It may be actually the server is kind of having trouble because there's a lot of people connecting right now, or I'm lagging. Might very well be. Uh, Alright, we got your stun there. One, two, three, yeah, alright. His cat is gone, so it shouldn't be too much of an issue. Uh, well, the way I play right now is not really not really that good. Like, there's a lot better ways to deal with summoners and everything in general, but... That should be it. Yeah, my... What the <laughs> Wow, what the fuck is going on, man? I really believe the servers are kind of struggling right now, because... Yeah, it doesn't make too much sense, really. Can I resist that? Yeah. Right. Oh, nice. Nice escape there. So, your counter is gone, and I'm gonna daze you. Really? Alright. Totally awesome. I wasn't that low. Like, the servers actually had some issues, like, half an hour ago. Or, well, it's roughly an hour ago now. So it may actually very well be the server why my cancels are still not working as they should. Uh, but I definitely need to work on those. But luckily we should be able to get the motion tower update in I think a week or nine days. Which would be would allow me to actually practice combos properly. Anyways, uh, I'm gonna try and focus this cat down first. Because he doesn't really pay attention too much to it. So that should work very well. Yeah, that works very, very good there. Almost dead, actually. If I get another CC off, I should have no trouble killing it. Alright. Not sure why he's healing it. Maybe he thinks he doesn't need his HP. Might be. Alright. I'm just gonna follow up and use my stun there. If my cancels do not screw up, and they do. But, there we go. Alright. And now this is a really simple fight, especially since I have a lot of HP. I'm not exactly sure why he allows me to take down his cat so easily. Like, it really doesn't make too much sense to me. Most summoners at least 
try to not get their cat wrecked so early. But, yeah, I don't know. This is really, I can just play around here and see him struggle trying to get me off or something. Right, we're just gonna finish this here with my old, uh, yeah, I guess the old build I use. Oh, I missed it. Damn you. He's still trying though, which is good. He didn't give up yet. You cannot do that right now. Alright, counter. And finishing there. Alright. That is actually a summoner. I'm not exactly sure how he actually reached platinum. I mean it's really easy to reach platinum, but the way he plays is just like really Searching for a match. I don't know, it's it feels kind of kind of really odd that he allows me to kill his cat so freely. You have joined the which, uh, yeah, which does make too much sense. Anyway, we're up against an assassin. I'm not even sure if I should be using my buff. I'm gonna stick to my ice guard because assassin is really, really rough for me yet. So, he'll probably dash behind me. He's level 29. Oh god, this is going to be horrible. Alright. Like, he lacks the skill points to actually do something. I mean, he can still kill me, technically, if I screw up. Which I basically just did, but yeah. I'm gonna roll backwards, he's gonna tab out. And, uh, yeah. Now he's both tabbed out and roll backwards. He still does his thingy and he can freeze me. Or not freeze me, but, you know. Oh, Poison, that was actually pretty good. So, it doesn't seem like it's his first PvP character, but, uh, alright. That was a nice stun there. Oh, nice follow-up. Hey, block my counters. I actually gotta play a bit more seriously, and I think I forgot to change my build back from... Yeah, I think I forgot to change my build back. So that means I cannot, or I should be cancelling, I guess. Uh, I'm actually dead. Defeat. I'm actually dead. Uh, yeah, the issue is this one was wrong. Alright, but I can change it back. And play a bit more seriously now. Like, don't worry, it's not like I was... He's probably thinking how the hell did this guy reach Platinum, so... Uh, what? What the hell was that? Alright. Oh, there we go. His stun is out. Or his stun defense, I guess. I see jack shit, but... Oh, that was nice. Alright, he's gonna roll backwards there. Yep. That was nice. Ah. Yep, I thought so. But there we go. There we go. And one cycle, two cycles. Oh, damn it. Why did he get his tap so early? Shoot you. Alright, we got another free rotation there. I'm gonna dash backwards and see if I can squeeze in. Oh, it's not ready. What? Whatever. And counter. Oh, nice. Oh well. Kind of miscalculated his tab there. I'm not sure, I, but I believe every class should have the same cooldown. Which is 33 seconds. Hopefully. Right. Oh, nice. That was, that was something different there. Please try again later. Yeah, so... That was a nice follow-up of the year, actually. Even though he kind of lacks a lot of skills, he plays really, really well. What? Why the hell does that cooldown... That's kind of bad. This is kind of bad. 
We're gonna buy some time there. It's not gonna roll backwards, is he? No. Please try again later. Alright, knock down. I swear I feel how the server's laggy actually. Like even basic presses are not really translating real really well. And it's kinda hard for me to Oh no uh, what? Uh -oh. Ha, got you there. Please move closer. You cannot do that right now. All right. What? Oh, really? Dude, come on. Come on. Hold on. Not again though. Oh, we just have to pop it here. There we go. This should be it though. Ah, that was not a full rotation. And I kind of screwed over. But he's dead. I can't say it's a really good match. I mean, I was struggling quite a bit, actually. And given the fact that he only gave me like 9 points, he's probably a lot higher than I am from the ranking. So props for this guy for actually giving me such a hard time, even though he's only level 29. That was actually pretty pretty good to see that some classes are really really strong early on like if he would be in a KFM or any or yeah basically a KFM at this level is not really that great so that was kind of really good to see that other people or like I guess it's good and bad because people complain about low level PvP being unbalanced and stuff which kind of is true but then again this game is not really based on Low level PvP, so if you want to get the full experience and full package, I guess, simply roll to level 45. It doesn't take that long, and you're gonna experience a much, much better PvP system than which is not completely derailed. I mean, sure, every PvP system is not completely balanced, but uh, it works, and it certainly works better than if you are level 30 or something. Anyways, uh, hopefully you guys enjoy another PvP match, and as always, see ya.